Now, in this video, we will see how can we start installing Oracle 11G Express Edition to our systems. For that, first of all, we will have to go to the official website of Oracle and we'll have to sign up. Once you are logged into the website, you can find and download the Oracle 11G Express in your system and then can start installing it. So let's find all such things practically. In order to install Oracle 11G Express Edition in your systems, first of all you will have to come to the Oracle official website that is oracle.com and here you will have to sign in. If you don't have any Oracle account, first of all you will have to create a free account out here and then just log in with that. As here you can see like welcome Anadi, that means I am already connected with this. After this you can simply come to the downloads and here you can see Oracle Database 11G Edi Express Edition. All right. If you don't get that, you can also make a search for that particular tool. So uh, let's click on this Oracle 11G Express Edition. Let's accept the license agreement. And as soon as you will do that, here you can see like different options are available. If you are working with Windows 64-bit operating system, you can go for this. For 32-bit Windows operating system, you can go for this one. And if you are working with the Linux operating system, you can come here. Since I am here working with the uh, Windows 64-bit operating system, so I'll, I'll click on this. And as soon as I'll click here, the downloading is begun. Once it is done, we will start the installation process. So once the setup is downloaded with a zipped file, here I have already extracted that zipped file and inside this I am getting the folder called disk1. If I will come inside, I will get a setup.exe, so I will simply run this. And here the installation wizard is getting loaded. Once the loading is done, you will be able to see this installation wizard. So just click on next. Here you will have to accept the terms and conditions. Uh, say next this is the location where your Oracle database will be installed and it is the selected version it is showing you the required uh, space for the particular drive uh, which I have enough so let's say next now it will ask you the password for the admin accounts such as sys and system when you install the Oracle Express Edition it automatically creates a database with the name XE and there are two admin users for that database one is sys and another one is system so whatever password you will enter here once you are done with the installation you will be able to use that password in order to do the login so here I will enter something and once you are done say next and here you can click on install which will begin the installation of Oracle 11G Express Edition in your systems depending on the basis of your configuration it will take some time this complete installation will be covering in a number of segments like installing the database software creating the services running that services and finally creating the database and now we are done with the oracle installation and now we are good to use this oracle database